Hello and welcome back to Polestar Driver. This week I did a test on the motorway to see whether regen is better on or off. So I planned a short journey which is roughly 43 miles um, down the M23 A23. Here you can see a better route planner um, of the trip. So it says 43 miles so let's go. So this first trip we did was with standard regen on. The only technology on the car that was set was a speed limiter to make sure we didn't we maintained constant speed for both tests. dashboard standard region is working as expected one pedal driving the more you lift your foot off the more region you get we turn around here and then we go back to the starting point and we averaged 61 miles per hour so now we turn the region off and we do the same trip again going on the car just carries on going and it loses speed relatively slowly on this area until I had to start braking to get down to the 50 speed limit which is coming up so as you see there as I take my foot off the brake it returns to neutral position so ie no region
as most of you know, when you press the brake pedal, uh, it will do um, motor braking first. Uh, so you do get some regen along the way, but um, the point of the regen off is that when you take your foot off the accelerator and don't brake, then the car coasts. So here we are on the return journey, back to our starting point again. And here we are back at the starting point. So for this trip, 42.9 miles, 35.9 kilowatt hour per hundred, took us 41 minutes, uh, two minutes less, and we averaged 64 miles an hour. So let's take a look at the results. So here I have recorded uh, the time that we started for each one, the temperature, and the first run was with region on, and the second run region off the distance is exactly the same obviously the average speed on the second run was slightly more and then you can see the consumption so kilowatt hour per hundred was 37.9 with region on and 35.9 with region off so two kilowatt hour per hundred less when you have region on i've converted that to miles per kilowatt hour so 2.6 and 2.8 I've recorded the battery start and end and how much we used and there's quite a difference between 27 and 21 but what we have to remember is that the first 10 percent of uh, the battery usage goes down very quickly so i don't know how much we can read into the the percentages used for battery start battery end and battery used uh, if it's two kilowatt hour uh, difference per 100 miles um, I don't expect such a big difference on the battery so that could be related to the fact that it was starting at 98% that's it for this week if you have any ideas of other tests you would like to see pop them in the comments below and we'll see if we can do those please like share and subscribe if you like these videos and thanks again for watching See you next week.